Yeah, we paid two pounds for these in, uh, in a charity. Ooh, <laughs> that's just taking everyone's eardrums out. <laughs> you naughty boy. Sorry. <laughs> Hi and welcome, I'm Paul. And I'm Marie. And we are a UK reselling couple based in Hampshire. And this is our charity shop video. Yeah, today we thought we'd um, go to some charity shops, didn't we? Yeah, it's Saturday morning. It's um, just coming up to nine o'clock. We've just dropped Emily off at her um, dancing because she teaches dance on a Saturday. And that gives us a few hours, hun, doesn't it? We normally have yeah. sort of... Um, Three or four hours, is it? We do. So um, this is what we choose to do on a Saturday morning. Mmm. Enjoy. Bamboo, that is. It's what? Mega bamboo. Chilly. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go in as well.
down the camera, look at the back. Of course his carriage is lovely. Twenty pounds. Oh, yeah. Nice little That's nice, isn't it? Um It's got chip. Yeah, I'm sorry. I thought that's worth I've never seen a planter. But I think the chip, I wouldn't want to risk it with the chip. Oh, that music. Yeah. Turning it the right way, yeah. yeah. Is there a button on it, though, to release it? Yeah. Open up the lid. Yeah. There you go. If you ask Dolly while you're at school, it's lovely, isn't it? It's like cigarette case. I think it is, yeah. It's gorgeous. Isn't it? She goes up and down, look. Yeah. I'll have to get mm. that. No idea, We're back from our charity shop run. Yep. It's bitterly cold. We've had a lovely <laughs> breakfast and look at all the tat we bought, hun. Show them. Tat, tat, tat. I'm shaking, I'm sorry, the, the camera's shaking. Well, that and it's really cold. <laughs> it is cold, yeah. Bitter, hun, isn't it? Yeah. So, really, yeah, yeah. we've got a lot more than we thought we'd get, so yes. that's good. Yes, that is good, isn't it? Let's show you what we got. We're back. Back from the charity shop. I almost forgot where we were. what it was. <laughs> we forgot. went to the charity shop. We did. But it was a couple of days ago now, though, wasn't it? Yeah. So, a um, bit forgetful. Yes, we went out on Saturday morning, didn't we? And, we did. Um, had a cheeky breakfast. Yep. And we go to four charity shops whilst our daughter is teaching dancing. We mm. are let loose around Hythe and the surrounding areas, aren't we, hun? We are. And um, we've been to, to four charity shops. And normally we only get a handful of things and we sort of gather a couple and then do a video. But this week we, um, we were loaded yeah, up, weren't we? Yeah, we've got quite a few bits. So, quite all, pleased. All the clothing will be in our Friday video. Hmm. Um, so let's go through what we got, hun. All this, this tack. Oh, shall I just go through the bits that we won't be... Um, we've got bits that we won't be selling. We won't be selling. Bits that I, I do like to gather. So we've got the... Um, We've got this banana from the Goodness Gang, which is a co-op toy. We'll be keeping this because we've also got a cauliflower. I'm, bu I'm building a collection, hun. Yeah. That's how sad we Doing are. A little bundle. Um, that was a pound, but we got that in Hythe um, on the way after we got Emily. There was like a Christmas festival thing going. That's right, there was, yeah. yeah. Well, I'll tell you about that later, so keep tuned. Um, keep this, tuned. Keep tuned. <laughs> Stay tuned. Stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs> this basket was 50p, so no, I think it was two for 50p. Yes, so yeah. um, it's not big enough or worth enough to list it as it is. So I'll just collect um, a few of these sort of baskets and bundle them. Um, yeah, um, we had some books that we bought, um, for 10p. This one couldn't go with any of the others we bought, so um, I purposely chose an Usborne book because they are um, 
you know, when you buy those new, this would have been fourteen ninety nine. Um, really? So I, I'm building a collection Christ. of Osborne books, but I've only got the one at the minute. Do you mean four ninety nine? Oh, is that four ninety nine? Oh my goodness, Hannah, I've got the glasses <laughs> on. Oh, I've just shown myself up in front of everyone. I, there. I was looking at it, thinking that's not fourteen ninety nine, surely. <laughs> Hashtag embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> and then I've got this book. Hum. Um, I don't know if this got damaged in transit, but it looks quite Ooh. severe. So I don't know. Um, we, we'll be coming on to these Star Wars um, books, but this one it is not, not made it, gone. so it will be going yeah. in the bin. Yeah. So there are all the things there that, um, I can't believe that, hundred fourteen ninety nine. what a wally. So why don't you quickly <laughs> move on so it d diffuses the situation. Right, I'll start sharing then. Yeah. The first one I'm going to share. We didn't know with this, did we? No. Didn't know. Oh, it's got me Sorry. <laughs> Puzzle. <laughs> It's a 2,000 piece puzzle. And, Some, um, sometimes the, the larger numbered ones, hun, like um, you know, 4,000, 5,000, can go with really strong money. So if we thought yes. we'd chance our arm with a 2,000 piece. What would yeah. it be sealed? It is obviously ripped. The make, I've, I've not heard Diamond. of Diamond. Have you heard of them? No, Diamond. Nor's, nor's Google. <laughs> no, oh, okay. <laughs> okay but, so I need to have um, another look. But, um, in a way, it's partially sealed yeah. because the, you know, it hasn't been out. But the uh, cellophane has um, has ripped in this sort of this sort of area. We paid five pounds. Yeah, we thought we'd risk it. With this, risk it, for risk biscuit. it for, for biscuit. Yeah, we we both can't talk today, and um, we're going to be biscuit <laughs> <laughs> and a coffee, and we're going to be putting this up for nineteen ninety nine. Give it a go. That's what we can do, isn't it? Hans? We bought it. Um, but definitely the, the higher numbered puzzles. Yes, the sort of the um, three, four, five, five, and what, six what was thousand. That make again? There was a make. Um, there was the Jan van Hasteren. That's the one. There's also those. Is it Hay or Hay? Hay, Hay, Hay. Yeah. Anyway. Something like that. But yeah, so that one we're putting up for twenty pound. Right. So I'm going to go for. Um, seeing as I've shown you the um, the goodness gang, I'm going to go for Garfield because we we were walking around. Emily. Emily's quite crafty. She's a bit like <laughs> a bit like me. She we picked her up and she was saying about this Christmas festival that was uh, there's basically around the High Street, wasn't it? Yes. Uh, in Hyde. Yes. And um, she was saying, oh, it looks really good. And we said, oh, did you want to go? Oh, oh I don't mind. Which meant she wanted some she chips. Wanted to, yeah. So um, so we parked up and had a walk around. And from a distance, hun, my reseller eye clocked this bad boy. Look at that. Oh, Em's. Hems. Uh, Hems. Oh, hun. Oh, hun. <laughs> Phone the home. <laughs> Not enough coffee. Thumbnail. This is a Garfield from 1981, hun. 41 81. years old. So Look how good he is. He's, he's cool, quite a chunky fella, though, isn't he? He is chunky monkey. And he well, he's not was. Monkey, he's his cat. <laughs> it was a tombola store, so he couldn't even buy these items. No. Home. So had the, to win them. the idea was you you got. <laughs> Three tickets for a pound. Yeah. Um, and so we saw this and I said to Paul, hold on to it because um, I'll see <laughs> if I can win it. So you you, <laughs> you were mouthing across the thing. Hurry up. <laughs> well, you, you were it looking over the other side of the stall. And I'm thinking, I'm stood there <laughs> like this, holding this toy as I'm looking. And you're, you're over there. And I'm thinking, it's because I, can, I, I can only pretend to look at him so... <laughs> It's because I spotted the banana and someone else had a strawberry and I was fuming. Um, so, <laughs> so, so, but yeah, Paul was mouthing, hurry up. Hurry up, get the tickets. It was bitterly, bitterly cold as well, wasn't it? It the was, weather had it really was turned, cold, yeah, yeah. And you were stood there like, holding, holding on to holding a Garfield. Garfield. But anyway, so we did win because, I mean, Emsy used to love doing that sort of thing when she yeah. was younger. So we got nine we got tickets. nine tickets, yeah. We donated three pounds to the charity and we yeah. did end up with um, with three things. So this is one of them. That's a very long way of saying that, hung. It it's is. It's a pound. Yeah, we if might, anyone's... might have to stop the video a minute and restart it <laughs> so long. If anyone's still awake, it was a pound <laughs> and we are going to be putting up for twenty two ninety nine. Forty one 41 years old, hun. I know. He looks new though, doesn't he? He is in s such good condition, yeah. Mm. He is. But yeah. Anyway, that's, that's half the video gone, just me chatting about Garfield. Yeah. Um, I think we'll end there, shall we? <laughs> <laughs> and guess what Marie can't leave behind? This was a beauty. In one of the charity shops that's normally quite expensive. 
So I did feel like yeah. I had a bargain here. Yeah, um, that, that is, yeah, they are probably really expensive, yeah. aren't they? So I've that's quite, it. yeah, quite it does surprising. Say, it does say it's done have the wrong price on, does it? I did get the price right. No, but they looked at it at the till, don't it? Yeah. Says, that's four pounds. Four pounds? Four pounds we paid for Just this. Just make sure it didn't say 14 pounds. No, no, it didn't, no, that's it. No, it's four pounds. It's lovely though, it's not shop. too chunky. Some people no. haven't got the space for a chunky one and that's um, it's quite nice, that, isn't it? Yeah, it's nice, nice little one. Um, we're going to be putting this up for twenty nine ninety nine. Ooh, hope to get about twenty four, twenty five pound, honey, for a realistic. Yeah. So then I'm going to go for the third item that we got. This took ages to choose because I'd already got the Garfield. We've got the banana. Didn't we needed a third thing? We, a third we knew thing. we'd won three things by then, but then yeah. it was slim pickings because it, it, everyone was all over the store, weren't they? Just it's, it's because you were going around saying, "I wanted that strawberry." I wanted that. Strawberry. <laughs> I did. I wanted that strawberry <laughs> to go with my. My goodness, gang. But anyway, I saw this tie, um, this, what was it? Oh, scared, does that say scary? Scaly, scaly. Oh yeah, um, of course it is. <laughs> and it's a pound. It's not worth, well, I mean, you always take a chance when you buy these tie beanie babies. Some of them are worth more than others. Yeah. Um, but I'm putting up for 9 99 Yeah. The pound was donated to charity, so I've, yeah. I've done my good deed. And <laughs> can also make a little bit of money, so... Yeah, it's, it's, really, it's really cool, isn't it? Yeah, it's a bit nice. different. Yeah. So that's him. You can sit there with the banana. Am I working along? Is there anything specific? You can specific? do whatever you want, my love. You go for it. Okay, I'm going to go for these shoes Ooh. then. Oh, it's in there. I'll put it in there. There's a little Just pack so in there. Just so make, make you go inside. Yeah, thank <laughs> you. <laughs> I haven't cleaned them yet either. Some Clark's um, I think they're shoes. called Flex Light. Flex Light. They Something. are. They are nice. Yeah. They're quite light, aren't they? Well built by the looks of it. Mm. Um, yeah, in pretty good condition. Soles are good. Um, yeah, we paid two pounds for these in uh, in the charity. Oh, that's <laughs> just taking everyone's eardrums out. <laughs> you naughty boy. Sorry. <laughs> Oops. Anyway. <laughs> what are we putting up for, my love? We're going to put... on. Let's pretend it didn't happen. <laughs> going to put these up for eighteen ninety nine. Yeah, sort of, you know, I think some go for more money, some go for over the 20, but I think that's a fair price, it's accurate, yeah. based on solds. They're not in bad condition. No? They're in pretty good condition. So I'm going to go for this little fella here, that we saw in the first charity shop. Now, at first glance, I thought it was a woman, but it, <laughs> it turns out it's not, hun. It's well, the, be funny, but it looks like Barbie. It does look like Barbie, and it's I think it's uh, like Ken. But it's Ken dressed as um, Beauty and the Beast. That's why he's got the big hunch on his back and got the clothing. And it's in quite a good nick, hun, for it's, I think it's a few years old. We paid 50p for it. I've, I'm trying to think of when it was from. I want to say the 90s, but I need to double check that because, okay. you know. Hair's a bit crazy. Yeah. But we're putting them up for 19 99 That's sort of a little bit ambitious for what it's um, what they're going for. But you don't see many with the whole outfit. Yeah. Um, in that good condition, I'll, I'll obviously give the hair a brush, but the hair's not too bad because sometimes it can be all matted, but it's not, yeah, is so it? Yeah, it's not been cut at all. It's obviously it? been put up or for has a while. It been, do you think that's been cut? I don't think don't so because I think it's meant to be shortish because yeah. it's a man, but <laughs> anyway, anyway, 50p put up for 19.99. See how we get on. Be on a yes. bit of collection here, hun. What have you got? I've got a. Oh. I've got a letter opener. Mm. Oh, that's quite sharp. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This was something we got out of the glass cabinet. We never we get just, anything out of the glass cabinet, do we? don't cabinet, go do in we? the glass cabinet, no. To be honest, I don't even look in the glass cabinet because I always assume it's really expensive stuff. Can I take that off just to show you? Yeah, if you want there? to. Yeah, that's it. And um, at the time, it was, um, we were stood at the till paying and I just clocked it, hun. Yeah. And I thought, oh, a pound? That's, that's oh, really nice. Oh, have I revealed it? I spoiled it. You have spoiled it for me. How much year? did you pay, then? I paid a pound. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> getting overexcited again. <laughs> Do you yeah. like a pound though? Pound items. Yeah, it's lovely. Um, and oh, it's it's like down. a souvenir brass, yeah, you know, sort of thing. And um, we're going to be putting this up for twelve ninety nine. Realistically, if we could get a tenner, we'd be lucky. Yeah. I think. Yeah, not but worth it's, it's nice. a lot. But it's a shame because it's, it's looks like it's well made. Yeah, um, a bit different though, isn't it, Hum? But yeah, nice weight to it. <coughs> Excuse me. Right, now I'm I'm going to go for, let's have a look at this lovely tree. Now, well, I think we had one recently. We did. Um, Something similar. They're quite sort of um, kitsch now, these sort of, um, 
these glass trees but if you have a look on sold you'll be surprised at what they sort of sell for this one was quite gorgeous because it, it I haven't done anything to it. it this is how it was on the shelf it's all been fanned out and and just lovely mm. it's nice where it's got the sort of that three or four different colors as well yeah so it was three pound and we'd had one before so I sort of knew roughly the pricing um, but it's actually going to go up for 29.99 hun wow um, so you know, if we can that. get 24 25 for that I think um, it's a bit of an unusual one mm. so let's give it a go hun give but it yes, a these shot these are actually worth a bit of money now if you see and I think you do have a tendency to see them quite a bit now mm. um, but yes that's that excellent what have you got this here. Oh. <coughs> Why did we pick this up? Oh, we were in the shop and we. I didn't know if it's a still book. You said no, it's no, not it's a still not. book. It's, it's, and then we did it and, and it's just a we did a bit of, bit of dilly dallying, hun, didn't we? We, we did. said, oh, well, let's just get it and learn about it. Yeah. And we, all I've learned, hun, is it's a plastic case. <laughs> it is a plastic case. That's we all shouldn't it have is. got it. We shouldn't have got it. Yeah, but anyway, it's just a, it's just a Blu-ray. Um, yeah. And. Um, might be good to watch, hun. Yeah, maybe. I think we probably will. Pencil that in for four years' time and we'll, we'll have a bit of time. <laughs> um, we pay 50p, didn't we? We did pay 50p, yeah. All oh, right. Is that so? Oh. No? No, I think it was 50p when it got to the... Oh, OK. It must have been teal. discounted then. OK, so that's not bad. Yeah. <laughs> 50 pence and we're putting up 3 99 Yeah, so not too bad. It's... We wouldn't get it again. No. <laughs> but you never know. We might have time to watch it over Christmas. So yes. who knows? Yes, yeah, definitely. Well, I'm going to go for something a bit different that I saw. And it's one of those things, hun, where it's, you don't really know if it is wood. I've got this. It's a lovely sort of orb or sphere. It's um, a trinket box. It was only a pound. That's sort of why I picked it up. It's a lovely sort of reddish wood. Do you think that's wood? Yeah, I think. I think it no, is. I think it is but wood, but it's not. It's got the lovely grain. But you know when you think it's very thin, it could be... It's got a plasticky feel, like, but I think it's it like is a wood. balsa wood type. Yeah. Style, but it's not. But, but I really. haven't found anything like it online, so I'm going to put it up. I've guessed. We bought it for a pound. I'm going to put it up for sixteen ninety nine and see how we get mm. on. Yeah, sorry, let's just go a bit. It's closer. either worth a fortune or worth not much. Not much at all. It'd be one, one, one of the two. Yeah. But it's a lovely sort of ready wood colour. Yeah. I'm never very good when I'm listing wood because I don't know what the wood is. Yeah. So I just put wood. Wood. <laughs> you gave me the price. I can't be wrong you? then, hun, can I? I can't be wrong. Got a couple of mugs. Now these are very similar style to the ugly mug that we had recently, but they're not. But they're not. They're not, I don't think. No. I think they're like a reproduction of the ugly mug. But they were... Oh, I was, I'm doing it again, hun. I'm taking over. If you want to take no, over, no, you no, can no, take no, over. No, 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 no. It's your turn. <laughs> they were 50 pence for the pair. I know. Two for 50p. I mean, that one is a bit They both need a clean, yeah, inside, it's a bit gammy. But, um, but yeah, they're not bad. 50 pence for the pair, and we're going to be putting them up for 14 99 Yeah, they do, even though they're not the official sort of ugly mugs, they do... There's still a bit of value, a bit of value there. Yeah. So that's, uh, I mean, probably 50 get, pence for the pair is, you know, it's, yeah, it's we'll great. Yeah, probably get about £12 if we're lucky. Yeah. So no, that will be all right. See it? how we get on, hun. Yeah. Well, I'm going to go for this. Sometimes you see something, and I do love um, toys. And when they're a good price, you sort of, you know, you sort of know you can get your money back. And when we saw this in the shop for £1.50, I opened it. I mean, I must admit, Han, I did think it was going to be electrical to start with because of these. Oh, these are sort of tra lights transparent. Yeah. I thought yeah. they would have lights in them. But when I saw the bag with the little bits and pieces in, I sort of thought I was onto a winner then because, you, you know, you know if you've got a place that bits and pieces have been looked yeah. after. Um, so one of these is not on. One of these shells is not on at the minute, but it is in the bag, so it just needs to fit oh, back right, on. Right. Ooh. Ooh. And all it is is you operate it from the back and the shells go up. Okay. Um, but I've had a look and they're, they've got a bit of age to them and it's worth a bit of money, so that's oh, quite okay. nice. Um, I'm trying to think what it was called. It's Aerials. I want to say Secret Palace, because I looked on um, I looked a couple of days ago, huh, and the memory's a bit foggy nowadays. <laughs> so we're going to list this for... £29.99. We said what we paid for it, didn't we? £1.50. £1.50, sorry. <laughs> yeah, I think it's like a sort of a Polly Pocket style sort of um, Air Disney aerial yeah. Super Palace. Yeah. So give that a go. Excellent. Oh, let's put that back there. What have you got? I'm going to go for another one of these. I'll take a picture. <coughs> oh, excuse me, huh? Got a bit it's of another gold. letter opener. Mm. It's from the same shop, wasn't it, hun? Same shop. Same price, pound. I'll see if I can get a bit closer again. There you 
you go. Yeah, I just thought it was quite sweet yeah. for a pound. I thought, wow, well, it's quite, yeah, it's quite cheap, nice. isn't it? It is. Sit on someone's desk. Mm. Um, um, same price, we're going to be putting it up for £12.99. So, yeah, that's cool, oh, isn't it? Then I've got this hun. This lovely sort of bamboo and woven um, star basket. Very nice, very solid. Mm, Gorgeous, isn't it? Good. Gorgeous. Yeah. It's, yeah. It's 50p, and we're going to be putting out for 16.99. Couldn't find anything exactly the same, hun. Um, yeah. It, is, it does surprise me, Wicker. Yeah. I must admit, some, some of some of the, the prices, prices. Yeah. Um, and um, you know, yeah, and it does sell reasonably well. It's just sometimes it's a pain in the jacks yeah, of the pack. Yeah, I didn't get anything <laughs> massive, did I? Well, I didn't no, get that No, I'm happy with either. this. I'm happy with this. But the good thing about these sorts of things is you can pick them up for 50p <coughs> or a Excuse pound me, because sorry. people people don't always know the value of them. Yeah. Um, but this can make a planter or it can be a fruit bowl or you could have, um, I don't know, anything in it really, couldn't you? you can. Anything small. <laughs> anything small, yeah. Yeah, so yeah. pleased with that. Oh, that's cool, that, yeah. It was outside, wasn't it, in the old 50p bin? Yeah. Right. Now, what have I got? Shall I go for these at the back, or do you want to wait? Yeah, no, you can do, my love. Is it all of them? Um, it is. I've lumped them all together, my love, because um, that's what I've done. Oh, these are going as one big lot. They are going okay, as one big lot. Can you those then? Whoa. Oh, almost lost them then, hun. Whew. So, we've got a big bundle of... Big reveal. Star Wars books. Star Wars books. Something we know nothing about, huh? Absolute nothing. Which is why we bought them, to yeah. learn. <laughs> so the shop that we bought them from, they were doing 50p each or four for a pound. So we thought, yeah. well, 25p each, you've got to make some money on that, oh, surely. Yeah, Ooh, throwing them about. Not now, hon. <laughs> Not now. Broken. So we thought we'd give it a go. Some of them aren't in the greatest of conditions. No, but no, for twenty five p each, you you know you just don't know. And Star Wars is quite a good brand, so we thought we'd give it a go. Yeah, yeah, quite a few there. How many is there? sorry? There's nineteen there. There would have been twenty, but that one was damaged. Yeah, so annoying. nineteen Star Wars books, mm -hmm. and we're going to be putting them. Oh, we paid yeah five pounds in total. Five pound in total. Yeah, total. And we're putting them up for thirty nine ninety nine. I know. I did look at doing them, set, you know, not not singly because only worth about two or three pound each. But I did look at doing them in smaller bundles, and then I thought, no, let's just whack them all together. Whack them all together. Put at that price. We might not get anywhere near that price. We might get more around the twenty twenty five thirty pound. But as Still, long as you can get two two fifty something like that a book, yeah, it's not bad, is it? No, no, that's not it bad. It makes at it all. a bargain for whoever's um, looking at getting them. Yeah. Because to get them from World of Books, you're looking at about the 285, 325 mark. Yeah. So by buying them in bulk like that, you can save a bit of money. Mm. So Definitely. is it my turn again then? It is. is. It? I'm going to go with, um, I think I'm going to go with the item that we, we disagreed about in the shop, hum. We did disagree, yes. We did disagree. This is, I do have a love for vintage things, um, but, but sometimes the charity shops, they do have an idea of the value of vintage things I, and you know I can see why yeah um, but yeah I, I, this I is, didn't miss this it's a gorgeous gondola um, sort of cigarette holder wrong way wrong way <laughs> it's a good start so if I oh if I wind it I don't know if it will pick it up on the desk no sorry you have to leave it and then leave move the case and if you can see that it spins around as the little doll does a little dance Copyright strike now. I don't think so. Not on that, you won't. <laughs> but it is gorgeous, <laughs> isn't it? It's inlaid wood. It's just slowly, it slowly, slowly goes turning. Around. I think you can see that. And we think this is from the 1950s or 60s. It's Italian. It's yeah. gorgeous, though, hun. It was it is. eight pound, which is uh, which is quite high for that's us. What, that's what we disagreed on, really. Because <laughs> there is some um, damage to the end yeah. here. Let me show um, you. That should have a bit more wood there. I did. Um, and her dress is a bit, you know, scabby yeah. looking, but she's old. It's because because of the damage and that. I just yeah, I just wasn't wasn't feeling it. Sometimes no. you don't when you see the damage on the end or not. But but yeah, so you can see her dancing. If I hold it still. And legs. But I could not get it home. We probably won't ever see one again. And it was so gorgeous. 
I'd, you it is, it's it like, is it's nice. like strips of wood, but you know, it's yeah. it's so lovely. It is lovely. There's, I, I, I'm not denying that at all. It is really nice. It all shuts off, you know, when obviously when you. But it's funny though, because people don't up. really have cigarettes these days. Do they? Don't see people with cigarettes anymore. They're all vaping, aren't they? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Whereas, yeah. whereas back in the seventies, someone would have opened that and it would have been like the the party piece, wouldn't it? Would you like a yeah. cigarette? Oh, yeah, that's it. It's so anyway, um, this is we disagreed about this one, and you wanted. I, I wanted Marie to prove me you wrong. You did want me to prove you wrong. Are you going to prove me wrong? I'm hoping so, hun, because <laughs> I've there's not many online. There's yeah. none on eBay of the same sort of a, like like this. So I've learned a little bit about it. Someone's mm. got on Etsy for over hundred pounds. Right. Um, but ours has got a bit of damage, yeah, so we damage are putting it up for. Well. She's proved me wrong. We haven't sold it yet, so don't. No. <laughs> 60, I'm not. Have I won? No, you no, no you do the big reveal. Okay, sixty-four ninety-nine. I want to hear you say it. You want to hear me say it? <laughs> eight pounds into sixty-four ninety-nine. No, but it's eight pounds. And I disagree. It's eight pounds into nothing at the minute because no, it's that's not it. it's, sold. It's got to sell. So if so. we've got it in four years' time, you can tell me that. You know, yeah, made a mistake yeah. <laughs> but yeah I mean but we'll give it a go it's I don't know I just love these sort of yeah, um, yes it is damaged that. but it's it's really old so it is and you know I'm not denying it is very very nice and for it to still be working after all that Ooh. time oh <laughs> Maybe I should put it should down. Should I put it down? Yeah, yeah I'll, give it, I'll give it back to you. <laughs> yeah, so that was my buy of the day really something just a bit unusual um, the fact that it's still working after all this time love it me now. Go on then, my love. Wow us with something. Wow you with this. Mm. What did you call this? When you picked it up? Oh, okay. I don't know. D it was, uh, I don't know, I can't remember. I can't why. remember. <laughs> you didn't say camel. Probably not. Probably not because I'm a bit daft, don't I? We got this camel. Uh, I don't know, is it actually for something? No, um, I don't it, think so. No? I think it's just like a wooden, because I've wooden, seen others online, it's a wooden, like just a, an ornament. a bit like a souvenir sort of thing. Yeah, but it's, it's very nice lovely. though, isn't it's it? Not, you know, it's been built lovely. And it wasn't overpriced Made really. Lovely. No, um, it was £2, is that? can't remember now, my love. £2, oh, that's not <coughs> bad. Resale price oh, either. Excuse me. It's going to be going up for twenty four ninety nine. Yes, yeah, so I don't know if the camera picks it up, but it's got a sort of a brass and copper sort of um, panel there, so it's quite pretty. Mm. You know, sitting on the side would look quite nice, wouldn't it? It would. A lot of work's gone into that. Yeah, it's all definitely. handmade. Mm. But yeah, no, I quite like that. Well, I'm going to go for something perhaps I shouldn't have got hung, but sometimes you get a little bit invested, don't you, personally, in something. Yeah. Um, I saw this in a charity shop for £2. It is a like a ceramic... Trinket box, and I don't know if you can pick it up on there. I'm not very good at doing this bit. It's because um, we have to um, go a bit close. Yeah, I'd have to get up, hon. Yeah, I know, you don't want to get up. I'm <laughs> trying to is... get the angle right, hang on. <laughs> I've got my blanket on, black. don't want people seeing that. Um, this is a oh, High Clear Castle, which is where they filmed Downton Abbey. Big Downton Abbey fan, and yes. we've well, been I'm there. Not. You are. We've been there, <laughs> we have been there. But I don't know. I didn't realise it was damaged inside. I don't remember it being damaged, whether it got damaged in transit, but there's no dust or, or remnants of it, so I don't know. Maybe it was, we just, yeah. Whether I just got a bit giddy in the shop and didn't look properly, yeah, that could be it. Yeah, just a little bit. I don't think you um, can pick that up on the camera. But. Can't find anything the same mm. online. I think it's made in Germany. I've Googled the um, where it's made. Yeah. Um, but it was £2, and I said to you, if it, if it wasn't worth anything, I'd probably just keep it, but... I'm thinking, well, give it a try for sixteen ninety nine. So why, um, why it's not bad sixteen ninety nine? No, why I think you said you sort of. Well, no, it shouldn't have picked it up. Well, because because it's damaged inside, it's always a little bit more difficult to sell something when it's damaged because you've got to make sure the person knows it's damaged and they well, look yeah. properly and. Yeah, there is that, but obviously you can't see that damage. On the side, on the you side. wouldn't notice. Um, if um, you've got a bit of a love for for Downton Abbey, then that's why. If it had been another type of castle, I wouldn't have bothered. But because it was Downton Abbey, I thought, yeah, no, okay, I get yeah. that because um, you never know, do you? A lot of people like the programme and a lot of people have been there. So mm. that's what I've done, Hum. So we'll give okay, it a go. We'll give it a go. Oh, we're okay, getting there some now, books. though. We are getting there yeah. now. You'll be pleased to hear. <laughs> now, we did buy from, from one of the shops. They had, it was children's books, 10 for a pound, Hum. That's right. It was, wasn't 10 it? 10 for a pound. You can't go wrong with that, no. can you? 
No, so these are ten p each. Yeah. And we've got um, oh, they're all famous five. All books. famous. What I did is I went for a um, an author that I thought would be popular. So yeah. went for Enid Blyton. Yeah. And I think all of them are famous five related in that bundle. Yeah. So I've split them really in two. Yeah. Because the only reason I've done that because I was going to do one big bundle. The only reason I've done that is because in one of, in one of these big books are two of the stories that were separate. Right. So I couldn't. You couldn't no one do wants it, yeah. the story twice today. That's it. So I've so, them. 50 pence, yeah. paid for that little bundle, and it's going to go up for 11 99 So then I've got this hun. This is a brass. It's not old. It's got Two's Company written on the back of it. Um, it's uh, like, a, I don't know what you'd call that. Like, it's it a just leaf. Like a, no, <laughs> is it? I didn't know if it a dish, perhaps. I don't know. <coughs> I don't think it's big enough to serve anything. No, it, it's just an ornament. <laughs> it's thing. just an ornament for the side, but yeah. I thought it was quite nice. Yeah, it is, it is a, it's sort of a, a little dish, isn't it? That yeah. you, you may have a couple of bits quite in, pretty. but it's not, not really. Um... So we're going to put it up for fourteen ninety nine and see if we can get £12 for it. Yeah. Give it a go. Give it quite a shot. Nice. I thought it was quite. It was only a pound. It's good for a charity shop, isn't it? Mm. Must have caught one on an off day. <laughs> that says fifty p, but it's because I've built in the price of that ten p one. Right. From there. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. So fifty pence we pay for this bundle as well. Mm. And um, there you go. You can see those. And we're again going to be putting them up for eleven ninety nine. It's not bad. So it's the same sort of. Um, oh, hang on. Oh no, it's different types. It's all Enid Blyton again, but right, okay. um, oh, that's some yeah. famous five. Right, oh, okay. Quite different. Mm -hmm. But there you go. That sort of concludes what we bought, hun, doesn't it? It does. So shall we go through the exciting bit? How, that's it. Mm. Got to move, just to move our book nearer so we can actually see. <laughs> <laughs> so this is how much we spent, hun. £41.50. Not it's bad, not, is it? Not bad, not bad at all. That's good for all that stuff. It's good for a Saturday because we only normally get about five things. Yeah, we do. So we, we you know, quite surprised there. Mm. So this is the listing value. Oh, not I bad. Know, not bad, is it? £446.79. And pence. And apart from what we've shown you that won't be listed, because it's going to be bon bundle fodder for, for the future, yes. yeah. um, it turns into 21 listings there, hun. Hmm. So do you want to run us through the... Um, the best you case, yeah. my writing, do you want to run us I'll, through it? I'll give it a go. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> okay, so we start with the eBay fees. So we start with £446.79, which is the listing value, and we take off the eBay fees. Now the eBay fees are uh, approximately 11.9% and then plus VAT on top of that. Um, and then you also have an order transaction fee um, with, with every order, which is 30 pence plus VAT. So your eBay fees would equate to £71.36. And postage, um, we're offering free postage on those, mm -hmm. aren't we? And it would be about £84. So the total fees and postage would be £155.36. And if you take that away from the 446.79, that gives you £291.43. And then obviously take off the uh, uh, what we paid for the items, which is uh, £41.50. That gives us a best case profit of £249.93. Which sounds really good, hun. Sounds like we're rolling in it, but... That's 21 items that have to sell before you get that money back. That's exactly it. Realistically, yeah. a third of those might sell within the first one to two months. Yep. But then, you know, you're waiting for that money to come rolling in, aren't Some you? of these will never sell. No. Um, that's, that's the, the reality the, this of is it. The reality of it, yes. You can but, price it up, yeah. but it might not go. That's it. So now let's take you through the worst case scenario because, um, you know, we're, we're realistic, aren't we? And mm -hmm. We put stuff up, we, we, everything will go up for what you've seen and what we've just shown you, but within a month we will probably put a sale on, yep. which will knock it down, we'll take offers all through the month, so before you know it, you know, we are lo losing money all over the place, taking, aren't we? Taking, <laughs> yes, taking, yeah, taking Because just because we've priced it at um, £40, it doesn't mean it's going to sell at £40, it could sell at £30. That's or, exactly it. Yeah. So let's go through the worst case, so we're going to take 30% off of our £446.79p, which already takes it down to £312.75p. We still have all the same fees, but they're a little bit lower, so they're now £52.16p. 
The postage is exactly the same, £84. So our total fees now are £136.16. If we minus that from the £312.75 we started from, that gives us £176.59. So it's looking a lot different from the £446, isn't it? Yeah. Then we minus off our £41.50, which is what we paid for all these items. And if we sold everything, worst case, um, we'd be looking at getting £135.9p, mm. which is not bad because we, we, our model here is that we try and get three times the amount back. That's right, three so times the profit is three If everything was to times. sell, mm. then we would, we would achieve that. Yes, that's but it. Realistically, it, you know. I mean, you know, we, 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 it's, it's not bad really because yeah. we, we would predict it will be around about the sort of two hundred pound mark. I would have said. Yes. That, that we Probably would more that. unlikely get because, um, yeah. like we like we always say, some items will sell at full price. Mm. Um, the a lot of items will sell on an offer, but you will also get items that just won't sell. No matter what you do, they won't sell. So you have to take that cost mm. into consideration. Um, with you, you know, and if you saw off your profit. our last video where we were looking, we did a sales update and we were looking at the time frame. Most of the items we showed you in that video had sold within a couple of months. Mm. So that is your really that first couple of months is your best chance of selling that item, isn't it? It is, yes. Um, yeah. So you know, some of these things will sell in that time for full price or on offer. I mean, so, that, yeah, that is that is your best time, I and mean, it's not saying older ones won't sell because no. they, they do sell. Uh, we have had items yes. for a very long time, and they, and and they, they have sell. still sold. Especially when you when you um, put them on sale, it just but it your, gives your whole store yeah. a bit of a boost, doesn't it? Your highest chance. Yeah, is in that, first, in couple that first, first couple of months. So yeah. that's why when we when we put price anything, we always look at solds because we mm. are trying to get the accurate price of what it is currently valued at. Yeah. Because we you could just you know guess a figure, and it could sit there for months and months and months. So our our aim obviously is to sell these items so we yeah. always check solds to get a rough idea of what they're worth yeah um that's how we gauge our prices turn it around get that profit in. yeah well we need the profit that's, to be able to keep going don't we that's it you need your profit there yeah definitely get that money in so really so. we um we've, we've done all right though. i think they're having the the gondola i think it was and the, and the toy the the doll there's quite a few things that have got a fair amount of profit we've yeah. done Done all right, haven't we? Really? Not been, too bad at all. I said yeah. done all right. We've been lucky. That's what a lot of reselling is. It's it's being lucky enough to be in the right, right place at the right time. That's exactly it. Yes. Um, getting there um, before someone else. That's what it's all about. <laughs> <laughs> that's what it's all Not about. Not fighting them. No, but it is though. <laughs> it is. You know, if, you, if you're lucky to get there and get something, that's what it's all about, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So as always, we want to say thank you very much for, for taking your time to watch our videos and support us. We're very mm. grateful, aren't we, honey? We are very grateful. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you for taking the time to watch our video and if you liked our content please like and subscribe to our channel subscription is free you just press mm. that little red subscribe button and uh, and then the notification bell oh and you'll be notified for our future videos thanks for watching thank you <laughs>